Yes, Ventrueler! And today I just wanted to give my thoughts on Ugly Sonic from the Chip and Dale 2022 movie. I think it's hilarious. They gave him the most generic, washed-up Hollywood actor voice. I also love how Sega is still embracing every version of Sonic. Because if you don't know, but a long time ago, Sega actually tweeted, everything is canon. At least when it comes to Sonic. So that means there's actually a parallel universe where Ugly Sonic is in the video games. That's horrifying. Another thing I loved about the scene was they asked Sonic to be fast. And Sonic said, fast? That's Sonic's thing. Ugly Sonic's thing is going slow. That actually reminds me, and I'm about to give you some behind the scenes, cute Sonic Heroes information. But a long time ago, I had an idea where Sonic actually meets more of his siblings. Because if you guys don't know, but Smart Sonic, a big supporting character in my series, Cute Sonic Heroes, is actually Sonic's sibling. Just taller and extremely dumb. It's supposed to be an ironic joke on his name. But when Ugly Sonic said that in the Chip and Dale scene, it just reminded me of that never before released Cute Sonic Heroes episode. The episode was supposed to have Sonic introduce Mario to all of his siblings. There was going to be a female Sonic where it's pretty much Amy, but Sonic style. And then like, he, like she's obsessed with Mario. And then there was going to be another Sonic where he's actually smart and he has all the like the... the goggles, he has the wrench, he builds and he's a mechanic and a scientist and all that. And then there was a, there was going to be a slow Sonic. That is literally just Sonic but extremely slow. Talking, walking, basically a turtle Sonic. As for the Chippendale Rescue Rangers uh, cartoon, that's from the 89, 90s. Like I've, I've never seen that. But the movie does look really funny, right? As my boy Sonic. Not exactly my version of Sonic, right? My version of Sonic is the adventure games. That's my favorite Sonic, right? Sonic X, the actual good Sonic that people like to see on the screen where his teeth actually look nice and not scary. Overall, 10 out of 10 cameo. It's very funny. It definitely pokes fun at Paramount and the animators. And my favorite thing is that Sega just embraces the meme. Embraces the fact that the Sonic trailer was... That design was just very bad. I still find it very funny that I was just so excited for the movie that I completely ignored what the design looked like. I was just excited for the movie. I didn't even care what Sonic looked like. I just wanted to see Sonic go fast and him beating up Eggman. That's it. Alright guys, if you liked the video, make sure to subscribe and please hit that notification bell so you're always updated on any uploads or posts. And if you really like my content, head over to the Patreon link down below. Thanks for watching.